Now one more result, equation of the pair of lines passing through x0, y0 and perpendicular to ax square plus 2hxy plus by square equal to 0 is b into x minus x0 whole square minus 2h into x minus x0 into y minus y0 plus a into y minus y0 whole square equal to 0. Now in the previous result number 1 we have taken this proof. In result 2 also we are carrying out the same here we know that the given equation ax square plus 2hxy plus by square equal to 0 always represents a pair of intersecting lines passing through origin. So let the lines be l1x plus m1y equal to 0, l2x plus m2y equal to 0. If you multiply these two equations you are going to get this. So we multiply and compare the coefficients. Now the requirement is equation of the line equation of the line through x0 y0 and perpendicular to 2 is perpendicular equation means we know we have to interchange x and y coefficient and we have to change the sign that is m1x minus m1 into x minus x0 minus l1 into y minus y0 equal to 0. Same equation of the line through x0 y0 and perpendicular to 3 is m2 into x minus x0 minus l2 into y minus y0 equal to 0. Again we require combined equation means we need to multiply. So combined equation is given by it is m1 into x minus x0 minus l1 into y minus y0 this is one bracket and one more bracket is m2 into x minus x0 minus l2 into y minus y0 is equal to 0. Again multiplication m1 m2 x minus x0 whole square minus l1 m2 plus l2 m1 into x minus x0 into y minus y0. Now last term plus l1 l2 y minus y0 whole square equal to 0. As usual we know the values of l1 l2 m1 m2 l1 l2 plus l1 m2 plus l2 m1. This is b into x minus x0 whole square minus 2h into x minus x0 into y minus y0 plus a into y minus y0 whole square equal to 0. This is our required result.